I love to spend time alone at the beach. Hello. Oh, hello. Look! <laughs> That's funny, when I saw you down the beach it looked like you were wearing a crown and carrying a sword like a king. Hmm. Let's build a castle for them. I brought these tools we can use. Okay. King and Queen! <laughs> The king and queen of Coronado were loved by all in the kingdom, from the captains of the court to the farmers in the field. They knew them to have a generous nature and to rule fairly at all times. Even the forest and the plains and the oceans loved them. All loved the pair. All save one. A sorcerer had lived for years in the castle, but after many lies and deception, he was banished from the kingdom. The sorcerer was furious and swore to seek revenge on the monarchy one day. He stayed away for quite some time as he built up his strength and mastered his craft. It was a dark day for the kingdom when he returned. He stood at the drawbridge and conjured up a spell against the very walls of the castle so that they could not allow the king and queen to leave and not permit anyone to enter to bring them food or supplies. Their castle home became a prison. The days wore on and their hunger was almost unbearable. The king knew he had to do something to save his queen, so he called upon all of nature to help them. He called upon the ocean, which began to churn with anger over the injustice of the imprisonment. Rise up! Rise up and save thy queen! The sea answered the call and rose up against the sorcerer and the walls of the castle. Now is your chance! Run! Flee! As the walls fell, the king and the queen were set free and ran to safety. But the sorcerer was swept up to sea and never heard from again. All was put right in the kingdom. Bye. I love to spend time alone at the beach.